I know Chiggs is in here recording or some shit. No Chiggs moved in here, right? So whatever you oh, say. Sorry, you know Chiggs gonna have, have everything up there. Whatever you say, Chiggs gonna be on YouTube with it, man. Whoa, like you. whoa, whoa. Here we are. What's up, guys? It's your boy, Chick Smooth. So after Peter Rosenberg randomly dissed Joe Budden on his podcast by questioning why he was 49 spots under Joe on the charts, Joe responded back with a little like this, basically saying that Peter Rosenberg is just hating on him for no reason, which, to be honest, everybody can see that from a mile away. Well, Peter Rosenberg went on his podcast with Cypher Sounds and responded back to Joe Budden, and here's what he said. Uh, he just went, yeah, Peter was around from the start. Peter, Peter, Peter. I got to work on a, on, a, on a Joe Button voice too. Yeah, but what more do you want? Pete was here. From Pete was here from the start. <laughs> what do you I, want? Pete, Pete, let's say it. I don't know what I want. That's the thing. What do I want? He's not going to give me. Thing. He's not going to write me a check for fifty grand and go, "Hey, thanks for." Uh, he's not going to go, "Hey, thanks for bringing me the studio. We used that for the first year. We, you helped get the podcast started, and then you got literally zero, and I've become a multimillionaire off it. I'm not asking for any money." But I will tell you one thing I'd take, Joe. I'll tell you this right now. You could, when my album came out, you could have had me on your podcast. Or now, when Syph and I are trying to promote one app, you could have us on your podcast. You ask me, Syph, what do I, what would I want from for being the person who sat in my apartment and helped Joe develop the idea to do it and, and believed in him and, by the way, got it right because he's a fucking star, and I, I knew that then. I don't want anything. Honestly, I love Joe but I wouldn't mind you reaching out and being like, hey, let me help promote your shit. I think he's acting as if, what is he supposed to do? No, the right thing to do, now that you've become the biggest podcaster ever in hip hop, would be like, hey, that dude, him and Saif had the, I've been friends with them forever. They started the first hip hop podcast. Oh yeah, and one of them helped me start my podcast. Let's at least have them up here. And as they say in the wrestling business, you know, g give them the rub. Oh, would you look at that? Listen, Peter Rosenberg, if you could have just come on your podcast and publicly asked Joe to have you on his podcast, I'm sure Joe would have obliged. A lot of times men have this ego that allows them to hate on something instead of just being themselves and saying what they truly want. I actually think it'll be pretty cool to see Rosenberg on Joe's podcast. I think they have a lot of conversation to have about different things. Rosenberg seems to think that he was an integral part in building up Joe's podcast. Meanwhile, Joe really doesn't feel the same. So I think it'll actually be cool to see them both sit down and have this conversation. Tell me what you guys think about this response, man. Push comments below, subscribe to my channel. Would you guys want to see Joe and Rosenberg sit down on the podcast? Push comments below, subscribe to my channel, like this video. I'll see you guys later, man.